Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hey, John. How you doing? Good morning. Uh, good morning, yeah, Art. Afternoon or whatever time of the day it is. That I, we have no idea. When you get old, you don't remember these things, right? It's not important. What? What's important is making resolutions in this brand new year, starting out fresh with goals in mind, <laughs> being a better person. All of that's what's really important, isn't it, Art? Well, you know what? I guess it, it must be important because you obviously are a resolution maker. I have to admit that I used to make resolutions, uh, but yeah. in the last couple of years, I have resolved not to make resolutions so that I don't break them. And I've done that. And that way you're year. always successful. I'm always successful. I, I'm now on about a three or four year binge of never breaking a New Year's resolution uh, because I don't make them. How about you? How about you, John? Uh, I used to make them, mm -hmm. and I have this, I've done the same thing unconsciously. I, mm -hmm. I don't consciously not make them. Uh, but I still find myself every year, January, trying to lose weight. Ah. I, I just It happens naturally. I just can't help it. Mm. So would I be saying, and how long does that normally last? A couple of days? If that uh, long? No, it... Uh, it's one of those wonderful aspects of my personality where I can think about something until it goes away. It just goes oh. away eventually. So in other words, I don't have to, you, you I, don't have to break it. It, it just, it, it never, it, yeah. it never is enforced. It fades. Okay, you know, so it's, it's not like in the old days when you would start and you would try to do something and then you failed. Okay, right. but so, right. and, and somebody would be yelling out, uh, uh, clean up the resolution mess on aisle, John. <laughs> you know, at some point. So, yeah. uh, so uh, have we? Let's say uh, we're already into the year by a couple uh, uh, days, weeks. At this point, yeah, uh, did it fade away already, or is it still in a, a mess? Oh no, uh, no, it'll stay with me for a, another mm. couple of weeks. You know, and that's fine. Mm -hmm. I can ignore it easily. Right. So, so your resolution, your resolution making is no longer a weighty problem. Would you say that? Oh, uh, thank you very much. No, uh, it's very punny of you. Uh, no, I, I, and I, maybe I'll come up with another resolution. You know, I've got a long list of things I should be doing versus the things I actually do. I never try to compare them. It's not worth the trouble. Let me I'm, ask you. Hey, let me let me ask you this, okay? And yeah. I'm going to say a resounding to the question I'm about to you for myself. No, have you ever made a resolution on New Year's Eve of any year, okay? Lo, these many years, and I'll just ask you to go back fifty of them, okay? Any resolution? And have you ever kept any any resolution that you've made well, on New I Year's kept... Eve? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, sure, I might have. I, I think one year I actually joined Weight Watchers. Well, and do you and, still belong? And it worked. Do you, do you and still? It worked. Well, excuse me. Do you still belong? Oh. <laughs> okay, so you broke. Years ago. How long did it take you to break that one? Six months because you signed up. For oh six no, months? that was good. That was good for nine months. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Weight Watchers, so it, that... and it works. It's great if you stick with it. You know. Hmm. So that was a good nine months, but uh, you know. Been there, done that. You know what? Why don't, why don't we look at it another way? You know, because I, you know, I, I really care for you, and I, I don't want you to feel bad about yourself. Is that maybe these New Year's resolutions, you, you fail at some of them, so that you have, you, you're perfect in so many ways. What do you have to do besides lose some weight? Let's say, I mean, is there anything else really that is wrong? You know, that could be I, improvement. You're. Uh, uh, why is uh, that wrong? Why? No. Why am I not the perfect weight? I'm so, the way God wanted me to be. Yeah, well. This is, this, and you're right, Art. You love me, and I'm perfect. <laughs> Thank you very much. In every way. Hey, What's know, the matter with John today? Oh, no, those, <laughs> can we do a song out of that? Yeah, it's always about me, isn't it, Art? I, so I think, I think that it's important that um, everybody understand that John, like probably most of us who, I used to make resolutions, New Year's resolutions about losing weight and other things, and stopping smoking until I quit 20 years ago, not on a New Year's Eve. Uh, well, that, that, it, let me just bring up a point. New Year's Eve is the worst. New Year's, particularly New Year's Eve, 
is the worst time to make resolutions. Is, oh, because you're drunk. Resolution. <laughs> and even even New Year's Day is a bad time to make resolutions. You got to make resolutions when you're clear headed, you know. Oh, well, that leaves us out <laughs> ever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you were going to say. You were, yeah, were some people say? shouldn't feel bad about it because what happens is, uh, let's say losing weight is something that we both want to do. Uh, yeah. it, it used to be for me just something that I could do on New Year's Eve if I had to make it, if I felt I had to belong and make a resolution, then I would always have something, the same thing. I knew it well. I didn't have to invent anything. I didn't have to figure out all the possible things I could, I could, yeah, I know what to do and I can handle this and I'll make that work. So it gave me something to do that I didn't have to learn something about every single sure. year. So I thought that was it valuable. It was familiar. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah, well, I think that was the same thing with me. It was so familiar, I could I just put it aside. Oh, yeah, that again. Uh -huh. uh, maybe next week or the week or maybe next month or maybe right. next year. You know, that's that's the way I dealt with it. OK, so, so let's say but, let, let's do a little recap here, John. A little recap. But, uh, so uh, we're part. No, 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 no. So, <laughs> no, 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 so, no, 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 so no, no. We, like most of the people who are watching us, are perfect in almost every way. OK, except in our particular case, and, and I think we both freely admit that we could both use to lose, uh, uh, you, uh, be, be valuable for us to lose just, a couple of pounds. Just the tad, yeah. Just a tad. Yeah. So, so um, I, I'm glad that we still have something that we could do to improve our lives. Otherwise, would it be worth living? <laughs> you OK. Were gonna, you were going to say okay. something, John. Did you forget um, about me? You know, what I was going to say is um, that our vlog on resolutions is like most of our mental machinations. I like how pretty you useless. use it. It's an M word, but I wouldn't yeah, use that one. Mental machination. <laughs> pretty, it's pretty useless. Yeah. But um, some of our major contributors have actually good suggestions mm -hmm. about resolutions. Bill Jordan's uh, video that we posted this week. Steve Campbell coming it's up. It's interesting. Steve Campbell coming up. Terrific about resolutions. That's ex actually, that's useful. How to, how to really uh, change your life. Right. And uh, Dr. Liz had, I thought, a fascinating take on resolutions. Don't make resolutions. You know, set goals. Mm -hmm. And uh, she had very good specific advice about that. So I would recommend to all our viewers that you ignore this video. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And watch Dr. Liz and Bill Jordan and Steve Campbell's videos. Okay, so I want to make sure I'm using this word correctly because you are our wordsmith. But, but by the way, which is why we have a lot of misspellings. But <laughs> but but your thought process, you're you getting the whole thoughts together. I mean, you're just good. Oh at that. yeah, uh, so, a deep thinker. Yeah. So would would we consider? Well, most of our uh, vlogs have some redeeming value. Some, not a whole lot. Some. Some. Yeah. Just would, enough to make you actually say. <laughs> would people be able to resolve that this was like 100% blather? Is blather a word? I don't think so. I, yeah. I don't think so, Art. I think we disguise it really well. Oh. Okay. After all, what, what could be more important in this time of year than talking about resolutions? I guess. So. Yeah. Okay, nice so, job, by the way. A nice job. I wanted to say thank you. Good job. You've done. This is this is one of our better, best ever. Uh, you know, why don't we have an annual uh, uh, beginning of year, end of year discussion about resolutions we haven't made or have broken? And we mean, can make that an annual event. You mean you want to have a an annual blather fest? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And we could at serve, some point, we could serve cold at, brewed blather. At some point, yeah. you have to say to yourself, I'm just full of blather and we've got to say goodbye. Goodbye. Art, it's been great. And by the way, if I, well, we did wish you, everybody, a happy new yeah. year last time. But, you know, maybe you, we could make it a little better. Why don't we say not just happy, but happy and healthy. Or Very good. Happy, good. healthy. And I, I do have one piece of advice for everybody since we're talking about New Year's <laughs> resolution. And I think the best resolution anybody can make is not to improve themselves, but to improve everybody else. After all, <laughs> that's what's really wrong with the world, isn't it? Because it's all about me. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye, Art.
Goodbye, John. Bye, everybody. Thanks for watching. And uh, and next week we'll have something a little bit more intelligent. I promise. Are you resolving that we'll have something more? No, intelligent? no, 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 no. Bye. But I did make a promise. I don't know what the difference bye. is. Bye. 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 For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.